is called, step forward and repeat the phrase you've been given. Understand? Number one, step forward. Hand me the keys, you fucking cocksucker. Number two, step forward. Give me the fucking keys, you fucking cocksucker, motherfucker! Knock it off, get back. Number three, step forward. <laughs> Hand me the keys, you cocksucker. In English, please. Excuse me. In English. I mean the fucking keys, you cocksucker. What the fuck? <laughs> Number four, step forward. It was bullshit. The whole rap was a setup. Hand me the keys, you fucking cocksucker. It was all the cops' fault. You don't put guys like that into a room together. Who knows what can happen? Hand me the keys, you fucking cocksucker. This has really got to be embarrassing for you guys, huh? They drilled us all night. Somebody was pissed about that truck getting hijacked, and the cops had nothing. They were hoping somebody would slip up and give them something to go on. They knew we wouldn't fight it because they knew how to lean on us. They've been doing it forever. I mean, our rights went right out the window. It was a violation. I mean, disgraceful. They went after McManus first. Top-notch entry man. What truck? The truck with the guns, fucko. Fucko. <laughs> he was a good guy. Crazy, though. You want to know what your buddy Fenster told us? Say who? McManus. He told us another story altogether. Oh, is that the one about the hookup with a dysentery? Fenster always worked with McManus. He was a real tight ass. But when it came to the job, he was right on. A smart man. What are you saying? I say he'll flip you. He'll what? Flip you. Flip you for real? Yeah, I'm shaking. Come on. OK. Answer my question. And you hit me in the back. Hello? I want my lawyer. <laughs> I'm going to have your fucking badge, cocksucker. Todd Hockney. Good with explosives. Without a doubt, the one guy who didn't give a fuck about anybody. You guys don't have a fucking leg to stand on. You think so, tough guy? I could put you in Queens on the night of the hijacking. Really? I live in Queens. Did you put that together yourself, Einstein? What, you got a team of monkeys working around the clock on this? You know what happens if you do another turn in the joint? Uh, fuck your father in the shower and then have a snack. You gonna charge me, dickhead? I'll charge you when I'm ready. With what? You know damn well, dead man. For Keaton? Keaton was the real prize for them, for obvious reasons. It was your mistake, not mine. <laughs> Did you ever stop to ask me? Hmm? I mean, I've been walking around with the same face, the same, the, the same name. I'm a businessman. Yeah, what's that, the restaurant business? <laughs> now, from now on, you're in the getting fucked by us business. I'm gonna make you famous, cocksucker. Like I said, it was your mistake, not mine. Now, you charge me with this shit, and I'll beat it. Okay? Let's get back to the truck, asshole. Oh. All right, really, 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 so I can do something about this shit. I ain't gonna hold it every five minutes. So I did a little time. Does that mean I get railed every time a, 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 a truck finds whatever it finds? Fuck um. Fenster, will you relax? These guys don't have any probable cause. You fucking ain't right. No PC, no goddamn right. You do some time, they'll let you go. You know, they treat me like a criminal. I end up a criminal. You are a criminal. And what you gotta go and do that? Trying to make your point. Well, why don't you make your point? You're making me tired all over. I oh, fuck it then. I heard you were dead. Oh yeah? Well, you heard right. Word I got is you hung up your spurs, man. What's that all about? What's this? Rumor has it Keaton's gone straight. I hear he's tapping Edie Finneran. Who's that? She's a heavyweight criminal lawyer from uptown, and I hear she's Keaton's meal ticket. How about it, Keaton? You a lawyer's wife? What kind of retainer are you giving her? Whoops. Hey, Fenster, do your friend a favor. Tell him to keep quiet. Dean Keaton. <laughs> Gone clean, huh? Say it ain't so. 
Or was it you that hit that truck? Mac, Mac, forget him. Did you get to talk to your lawyer? <laughs> this whole thing was a shakedown. What makes you say that? How many times you been in the lineup? It's always you and four dummies. PD are paying homeless guys ten bucks a head half the time. And there's no way they'd lie in five felons in the same row. No way. And what's, what's a voice line? Public defender could get you out of that one. So why the hell was I a strip search? I was the feds. I took a lot of guns, get snagged. Customs comes down on top of NYPD looking for answers. They come up with us. They're clutching at straws. Ah, uh, the guy's fingered my asshole tonight. Is it Friday already? Yeah, I love her, boy. You want a piece? Jump in, I love you. So who in a goddamn piss hell stole that fucking truck? Ugh. What did you say? Who stole the fucking truck? I don't want to know. Who asked you, working man? Fuck who did it. What I want to know is who's the gim? He's OK. Says you. How do I know that? What about a pretzel man? What's your story? His name is Verbal. Verbal Kent. Verbal? Yeah. Roger, really? People say I talk too much. Yeah, I was just going to tell you to shut up. We well, met before once or twice. In county, I was in for fraud. You were in the lineup then, too. What happened? I walked 90 days, suspended. So you did it. All right, now look. We've all been put out by this whole thing, right? So I figure we owe it to ourselves to salvage a little dignity. Hmm? Now, me and Fenster heard about a little job. Why don't you just calm down? What do you care what he has to say? I'm just talking here. And it seems to me like Mr. Hockney wants to hear what I got to say. And I know Fenster's down. What about you, guy? I'm interested, sure. There, see? So now I'd like to exercise my right to free assembly. Why don't you just shut up? You're missing the point. No. You're missing the point. I don't want to hear anything from you. I don't care about your job. And, um, I want nothing to do with any of you. I beg your pardon, but you can all go to hell. Dean Keaton, gone the high road. What is the world coming to? Fuck them. And that was how it started. The five of us being brought in on a trumped up charge to be leaned on by halfwits. OK, now I really can't talk about it much here. What the cops never figured out, and what I know now, was that these men would never break, never lie down, never bend over for anybody. Anybody. <laughs>